in 1989 a very powerful picture for the world's attention it was taken in tiananmen square beijing during the protest for democracy in china the photograph called tank pan showed a regular man standing alone in front of tanks that were coming towards him this image has become a symbol of bravery strength and the human desire for freedom in april 1989 peaceful protest began in china with people demanding political reforms and more freedom of expression the protest reached their peak in tiananmen square where students and civilians gathered to voice their concern about injustice and corruption in the government but the chinese authorities responded with force and on june 4 1989 there was a violent military crackdown many protesters lost their lives during the tragic incident the photographer who took this famous picture is jeff widener he was a photographer for associated press and was focusing on the tanks when suddenly a man in a white shirt and dark trousers appeared carrying what looked like shopping bags at first jeff was annoyed because the man came into his shot jeff thought the man would ruin his photo but little did he know that he was about to capture a historic moment jeff had been in beijing for a week to cover the protest and he was deeply affected when the violent crackdown started the beijing hotel 6th floor balcony provided the best view of the square an american exchange student crick martson helped him sneak in but it was not a safe spot with bullet holes around the balcony despite the danger jeff knew he had to capture the truth as a photojournalist he positioned himself on the balcony overlooking chang'an avenue a major road leading to tiananmen square when the man confronted the lead tank standing directly in front of it jeff was ready with his camera the tank stopped and tried to go around the man but he kept blocking its path at one point the man climbed onto the lead tank and appeared to talk to whoever was inside eventually the man was pulled away by onlookers and to this day no one knows who he is or what happened to him and he became a powerful symbol of standing up against oppression the chinese government tried to control the information going out to the world and banned photos and news about the protest rick martson helped chef smuggle the tankman film out of the hotel in his underwear chef's picture was sent out to the media outlets worldwide and his photo of tankman was used the most it appeared on front pages of newspapers and was even nominated for pulitzer prize even today tankman and any mention of the massacre are banned in china the photograph continues to remind people of the courage and defiance shown by an ordinary man standing up for what he believed in and his message still resonates worldwide